This is the High Performance Corner, a closer look at the fastest race boats in the world. Three drivers, Jim Cropfeld, Steve Reynolds, and Scott Pierce, will be driving in enclosed cockpits in 1986. It's state-of-the-art. They're built for safety. Let's find out about the enclosed cockpits from these drivers. Well, naturally, Jim, the, uh, the likes of it has to be the safety aspect where I am uh, strapped in uh, in my seat. I have the uh, roll bar and roll cage around me and the plexiglass uh, F-16 canopy on me to, to keep the water off from rooster tails, etc. Dislikes, uh, really not much. Uh, I think the most dislike I have is probably the temperature in there without air conditioning. It, it gets up around 150 degrees and it's just too hot. Like Jim Cropfield, I too am concerned about the heat. But the advantage that I have and that I really enjoy is the fact that I have far more visibility than I had before. We've cut the canopy here, the cockpit down a little bit lower so that I can see safety is my primary, my like for it. I really enjoy the safety factor. Visibility, safety, two big pluses for the canopy. Well, as the newest member of the Miss Budweiser racing team, I have double duty. I have to get used to this new uh, Miss Budweiser and uh, also get used to the cockpit. 4,000 horsepower, I have my hands full at this particular point, but the canopy makes me sleep well at night, and uh, if there is any drawback, the heat is a drawback, but I have a cool suit, and it seems to be working fine so far, so uh, I'll just learn how to drive this thing and win some races for Budweiser. Another feature of the 16th annual Budweiser Regatta is the seven-liter class. Many of the unlimited hydroplane drivers you know today, the Chip Hanauers, Jim Kropfeld, Steve Reynolds, Scott Pierce, many others, cut their teeth on these boats. And now it stipulates in the rules for the unlimiteds that you have to have several hours of racing at the seven-liter class before you can drive an unlimited. Another aspect about this Miami race is that the money raised through the unlimited race here in Miami helps finance several other limited races throughout the year here at Miami's Marine Stadium. So it's brother helping brother, and it's a lot of fun. Miami's Marine Stadium after this.